The business Apple has in China has become a hot topic among a number of stock and technology analysts. This is especially hot right after an earnings report like the one Tuesday. Apple's Tim Cook explained during an earnings call of how important China is to Apple. Numbers like sales of iPhones are up by 13 percent worldwide, but in China they are up 48 percent. iPad sales were down globally, but up in China by 51 percent. Then the talk by analysts turned to success and failure that Apple has undergone over the past quarter. iPhones are in fourth place behind Xiaomi. Xiaomi looks to extend their lead with a launch yesterday of the new Mi 4 smartphone. Then again, anticipation of the new iPhone 6 has the largest manufacturing order into Chinese suppliers ever made. Other comments are toward a failure of new innovation. Apple hasn't surprised the public since the launch of the iPad tablet computer. And there are speculators saying the iWatch will be launched this fall and become the answer to innovation-starved Apple consumers. Even when you see that Xiaomi is outperforming sales of iPhones, Apple still retains their mystique. The numbers then reinforce just how well the company is doing. Apple's gross margin was better than expected, at 39.4 percent, up from 36.9 percent a year ago, primarily due to cheaper product costs. Net income jumped 12.2 percent to $7.75 billion, or $1.28 per share. That beat expectations of $1.23 and was its best quarterly growth in earnings per share in seven quarters.